Hi children, welcome to lesson 12 of my Learn to Write series. Now we're on the ladder letters at the moment and we've done U uh, and we've done I. Now t, t, t is exactly the same as the U uh, and it is another tall letter. So I'll show you how it goes first. You're going to start at exactly like U, uh, up we go, and it is a tall one. Tall, 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 all the way up to the top. And then down, down, down. And instead of doing a little flick, we'll have a bigger flick to make the bottom of that t, t. pen off cross your letter t, like that. Okay, remember how we practice with our magic pencil. So, get your magic pencil, sharpen it up. Ready? Start at the bottom. Up, up, up. It's a nice tall letter up to the top. Down, down, down. And we're not going to do a little bit, we're going to do a big one. Pen off, and we don't normally say that, do we? But this time, we need to take it off to cross over our letter t. Let's try that again. Up we go. Up, 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 make our long ladder shape, down, 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 and a big flick out like that to make the bottom of our letter to pen off, cross it over. Okay, we'll try that one more time, shall we? Up we go, up, 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 the top, because it's a nice tall letter to down, 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 and a big flick out, pen off the page, cross it over. Fantastic. Let's go and practice that on some paper. All right, so we have practiced our letter U, we've practiced our letter E, and we're brilliant at those. We're on to the letter T, -t now, which we've practiced in the air. Um, now, the letter T is almost exactly the same as the letter U to start with. So let's have a look at that letter U again. Starts on the line, up we go. It's a nice tall letter, and then it has a little flick out at the bottom. That's our letter U. When we did our E, it was exactly the same again, but a bit shorter. Up we go, down again, and this time we popped a dot on the top. T is another letter that we need to take our pen off the page. Let me show you. We're going to do pretty much the same as the L. So we're going to go up, and it's a nice tall letter. But this time when you flick under, do a bit of a bigger one, like that. Then your pen is off, and we're going to then cross over the big tall stick. And look, you get your T. Let's try that one again. Up we go. Nice and tall. Do a really big flick under for the bottom of the T and then cross over your T. Well done. Up we go. Under and cross. So you see we do take our pen off the page with this letter. Which is one of the few that we do take our pen off the page for. When you've had a little practice, if you're still worried about it, get a grown up to do it first for you in a lighter colour, a pencil or a yellow. Doesn't matter exactly where that crosses, that's fine. Then you go over the colour, the yellow pen with a darker colour. There you go, pen off, cross over. Start on the bottom, up we go, nice and tall, all the way down, a big flick under, cross over. And then you can choose some different colours and just make it fun. If you've got any sparkly pens, choose your favourite colour, do a pencil, do a thick pen, do a thin pen. We're just practicing that journey that we want our pen to take. Up we go, down again, a big flick, and then a cross over. Up we go. It doesn't matter too much with the cross. It could be mainly on that side, or you can have a bit sticking over that side as well. It doesn't matter too much, as long as there is a cross. Fantastic. Let's go and practice that in a more interesting way. Well done, everybody. Well done for practicing your letter t, t, t. Now, the way we're going to practice today is to use salt dough. You can use play dough if you have it, or you can make salt dough. And for that, you will need some flour and some salt and some water. Let me show you how to do it. So I've mixed up some, made some homemade play dough or salt dough by mixing some flour and salt and water together. And then I'm going to make it into two big long snakes that are going to be our pencil lines to make our letter T -t -t -t. So the first one needs to be the long one and you should just roll it and roll it until you get a long one. Whoops. And it doesn't matter what it looks like. And then we're going to do a shorter one, which is where we're going to cross over the letter T. So here we go, there's our long one. And then we need a short one. 
There you go. So here we go. We're going to make our tuss. We're going to go up, 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 up. And then we're going to go down the same way, down, down, down. And there's the long flick, the big long flick. And then you're going to cross it over. You can do it that more that side if you want to make your letter T. So your pencil line goes up, down the same way. You want the big long flick out and then you're going to have your cross. OK, so you can try that again. Start at the bottom. Here you go. Up we go. And then down we go. The same line. We have our big long flick out and then we're going to have our T. Can cross over, we can go at the front, up, down, and cross over. Let's try one more time. We've got our long salt dough snake. You can use play dough, obviously, if you have that. Up we go, down, 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 and then you're going to cross your T over. There's your letter T. T, T, T. Fantastic. Well done. You can practice that as many times as you like. Brilliant.